So we're going to do a couple new things and review. Okay. First thing we're going to do uh, is I'm going to put up here the basic stuff we've already had, the position time graph and the velocity time graph. Okay. So on a position time graph, okay, I'm not going to put anything on here yet. Can somebody tell me what does the slope mean? The slope means what? Velocity, or represents velocity. Okay. Why is that? Delta y over delta x, now this should all be review. Delta y over delta x has units of what? The change in y is meters, the change in x is seconds. Okay. On a velocity time graph, on a velocity time graph, what does that delta y over delta x, what are the units? What's the change in y, the units on a velocity time graph? Meters per second. Okay. Change in x is in seconds. A meter per second per second, this is an improper fraction, that's why there's the algebra requirement for this course, is a meter per second squared. At this point, after doing all those homework problems last night, you should recognize what that's the unit of. What is that the unit of? Acceleration. Acceleration. So here, slope means acceleration. All right, so that's the review. That's where we're at at this point. We know what slopes mean on these. Okay. Now, whoops. Slope means velocity. There we go. Okay. Slope is velocity here. Slope is acceleration here. Now we're going to add something else. Okay. Uh, first of all, I'm going to show you that this doesn't have meaning on an acceleration time graph, or doesn't have meaning to you guys. What would be the units? of the slope. It'd be a meter per second squared per second. That's a meter per second cubed. Have we talked about anything with units of meters per second cubed? Mm -hmm. No. So does slope always mean something? Mm -hmm. No. Now this does have this extra derivative or this extra calculation slope does have some meaning. It's the change in the, ch it's the, change in the acceleration over time, right? Which is called the jerk, uh, literally. But we're not, I didn't make that up, but we're not going to be talking at all about that, and usually you don't have to deal with it. Okay, so it will not have meaning in this class. Okay, so slope doesn't have meaning there. It doesn't always mean something. Okay, now we're going to do something else. We're going to talk about the other thing 